Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am excited to share with you guys a bunch of stuff that I got recently. My mom is here visiting right now and of course, whenever she comes to visit, we have to go on a huge shopping spree since we don't get to shop with each other very often. With that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and just jump into this haul because I have a lot to show you guys. I'm gonna try to link as much as I possibly can. Okay, so I just switched positions because I don't think I was getting very good lighting over there. So this is the new cup that I just bought from Etsy. And of course I had to switch out the lid. It comes with a clear lid on top if you guys don't like the pearl one. And then this straw is actually one that I already had, but I bought a baby pink one as well off of Etsy to go with the cup. I'm 21 weeks right now and I'm out of breath <laughs> already. <laughs> just started filming. I don't even know where to start. Oh, you know what? I'll start with these. These beautiful baby pink slippers from Hobby Lobby. Vanessa and I decided we wanted to jazz them up a little bit. And of course, you know, my girlfriend has an, Et an Etsy shop where she does koozies and slippers all the things literally <laughs> coasters and I talked a little bit about her page in my last video as well but I just love all of her stuff and she's so creative I'm hoping that she ends up selling these in her Etsy shop because they are just stunning tilt this down really quick so you guys can see baby bump and my pajamas I'm wearing pajamas right now because I wanted to kind of do a little bit of a cozy outfit for this video. And I will have the link for this as well. It is super comfortable. I'm wearing a size medium just for reference. Okay, so a lot of this stuff I've kind of already been using and a lot of it is out of the bags. But for the most part, I know where I had purchased it from. So, so I got this backpack. It is Juicy Couture. It has the beautiful iridescent rhinestones on the front. And it has a cute little zipper here. And then the big zipper up top. And then inside, um, it has like two pockets in the front and then a little zipper in the back, which is nice. This holds a bunch of stuff and it's perfect when you have kids because you just throw a few toys in there along with your wallet, keys, sunglasses. If you guys want to see what's in my backpack, let me know in the comments down below. Maybe I'll do like a reel or something on Instagram for y'all. And I got this at TJ Maxx. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to share with you guys is the jewelry stand that I got from Home Goods. It has the marble tray on the bottom and then this is all silver with little rhinestones on the top, which just totally sold me. I wish all of them had the rhinestones on them, but I just thought this was very elegant and perfect for some simple jewelry that I have, little bracelets, necklaces, longer necklaces. I do already have one. I'll show you guys. Right here is my other jewelry stand. And I got that one also from TJ Maxx, but it's just so full. So I wanted to get another one. Currently just have it on my vanity. And eventually when I get around to it, I will start adding some jewelry to it as well. Okay, so next up is this stunning bow. I have been looking for this dang bow since my girlfriend Vanessa got it. When she went, there was only one. We went back to Marshall's, I think it was just Saturday and I could not find it and boom, there it was in a different section than all the other bows. There was like a bow section and then another kind of hair section and that's where it was. It was hidden in the back and let's just take a second to appreciate the details. It is very heavy. Seems like great, great quality. And it's just a clip on the back. And this was at Marshall's for $12.99. And then my mom and I, when we went shopping, we found these really beautiful bow earrings. 
and we both got matching pair and I just thought that they were so adorable and these were I don't see the price tag on them but I think they were like $12.99 and then I also got a few of these bows. I definitely want to add some either pearls or rhinestones to them just to kind of jazz them up a little bit because they are fairly simple and we all know that I'm just not a simple girl. And these were $5.99 at Marshalls. I also picked up this really cute baby blue skirt and it has a bunch of different colors that you can wear with it as well. So it has other, well actually I would say this is more like a mint green because this is more baby blue on there and then pinks, yellows, more of like a darker green. I don't know, I just thought that this was really cute. Definitely needs to be ironed, but I could wear it over my belly and it's still long enough. I have a yellow one piece bodysuit and I think it would be really cute with that and some high heels. This is from Marshalls for $9.99. been using this so it's kind of a hot mess but this stuff smells like the cheap version of Baccarat I swear to you it's crazy it smells amazing and my mom ended up getting this little travel case for me for Mother's Day and you can I believe you can still get them at Sephora so I'll leave a link for you guys if you want to get the cute little set set comes with a little spray and then a body wash and this little travel bum cream, which I love this stuff. This lotion is amazing. I actually have a big jar of it in my vanity. That's a really cute case. I'm actually missing a nail right now, but ignore that. I actually just buy my nails on either Amazon or TJ Maxx. These, these were $3.99 at Marshalls. I think these were $5.99 on Amazon, you guys are gonna be so proud of me. I finally caved and got a vlogging camera. So then I can actually film stuff outside of my closet. Got a really cute little travel case to put it in. And then this is the camera that I got. Comes like a little poof ball on top. I just see so many vloggers and YouTubers with this camera. And I heard it takes really good pictures as well. So I figured I would give it a try. It's smaller. It's more compact than the one that I used to use. And then I got this really cute, really, really light baby pink cover to go over it and protect it. I also got an adapter because I am probably the only one that does this, but I edit everything off of my phone. So I don't have to always have my laptop with me. And so I got an adapter so I could just upload it right to my phone. I'm excited for all of that and for better quality YouTube videos and vlogs to come along because I know you guys would love shop with me videos and that's my plan. <laughs> all right. And then I went to Ross and I picked up these really cute baby pink socks. I think it was a set and then somebody either stole some of the socks or they got misplaced and they were only 98 cents. And I also picked this up from Ross. It is so cute. Obviously, I love coffee patterns because this robe has a bunch of like coffee and cupcakes, donuts, little egg, like a little egg face. I don't know. I just thought it was really cute and it's a pretty shade of pink and it's a very light robe for especially when it's hot here in Texas and Hobby Lobby was actually having a sale on their cups and I decided to get two of them with a gold rim it's just a very very light shade of pink and these were only $2.99 a piece so I thought that was a steal I love my golf dresses my golf skirts and I saw this really pretty it looked baby pink online but of course it was not baby pink when I received it it's more like this peachy coral light peach coral color it's still beautiful color. I decided to keep it. This is what the dress looks like. I don't know if you guys can see. I decided to get it in a size medium so I could still wear it pregnant. What I love most about it is that it has the detachable shorts that have pockets on it so you're not constantly having to lift it on and off to go to the bathroom. And then I got this really cute bow set from Amazon. 
and I love these cute little tiny bows. I like to braid my hair and wear them in the two braids that I do. And then it also came with these longer ones, which are perfect for your hair as well. TJ Maxx, I ended up picking up this really cute PJ. It says, no bad days. <laughs> And this is my favorite kind of pajamas. It's the Ray Dunn set. And it has this really pretty baby pink color with leopard on it. And I got a size small because it just did seem like it was oversized more. I don't know if you guys can kind of see. So yeah, those are my favorite to wear at night. Kind of like the one that I'm wearing right now. And then I saw this at TJ Maxx and I thought it was the cutest dress for summer. I probably won't be able to fit it in it right now because I believe that this is a small, yeah, it's a small. Um, but next summer I definitely will be wearing it. Or if it's not too short with my baby bump, then maybe I will wear it this summer. Well, I guess we'll just have to wait and see. I went to Target. I blame my girlfriend off of Instagram, Bria. I saw this on her YouTube and I had no idea that Target had all this cute little Barbie merch and I don't go crazy over the Barbie stuff. There's just certain things that I'm like, oh my gosh, yeah, I really like that and I'm going to get it. And this is one of them. So it had this really cozy, comfy sweatshirt. You guys can see the matching skirt, matching tank top. This will definitely be an outfit when I'm not pregnant. <laughs> this I can wear. I got it in a large so then I can wear it as pajamas. This I picked up from TJ Maxx. So it's $12.99. It came with the really cute white rhinestone juicy shorts and then the baby pink juicy shorts. I just love these to throw on. You can either wear even wear them with the dresses like these, the nighty gowns, but I like to just wear some comfy shorts around the house, especially when I'm doing chores. This was from Ross, it was $3.99. I just loved the rhinestone heart in the middle. I have not seen one like that. And I love using these for when I wash my face, sometimes when I do my makeup, but I wanted a nice new one for traveling to keep nice and keep with all my travel stuff. Next up at Ross, I picked up this really pretty baby pink dress. It gave me coquette vibes with the little rose on the top. I ended up getting a size medium because it looks super short. And even though it's 100 degrees here, I still ended up picking up the sweater from Ross as well because it was only $9.99. And it's a crop and I love to wear crops and like little tanks in the winter with some cute jeans or like a skirt. And then this is also from Ross, this was $6.99. And they're just some baby pink shorts. I got these in size medium and it says Malibu on the butt, which I thought was really cute. So I caved and I don't know if you guys have seen the latest Stony Coat Clover release but they did a ballet collection. And first I was like, oh my gosh, I'm not spending that. And then I just kept thinking about it. And I was like, I love the pearls. I love the rhinestones. And I ended up caving and purchasing these. Look at how large this is. This would fit a lot of stuff. And then I also had to get this one because I just thought it was just absolutely stunning. And there's a bunch of, I like to keep the stuffing in there to keep it shape, but it comes with like a little brush holder, which I thought was nice. And it just would fit a bunch of stuff in here, a bunch of cosmetics, bottles, makeup, whatever you want to use it for. I'll probably use this one for makeup. And then they also came out with really cute bows. So you can, I guess, customize them. I didn't want anything on mine. I just wanted mine plain. Most perfect shade of baby pink you guys can tell it's just stunning. So I've already started to display these in my room. Yeah, so I'm really excited about these. So I know this is a little early because it's not Christmas time at all, but I picked up these really cute socks from a girl on Instagram. I will leave her shop and her handle down below. 
for you guys if you're interested in purchasing anything. I have a huge, huge haul coming from her. You guys are gonna flip if you have not seen her stuff for Christmas. You guys are gonna flip when you see it because it's total gingerbread pink vibes and yeah, I went a little overboard. And Christmas is my favorite time of the year and that's, I'm just gonna justify it with that. Are the socks, they have little pink bows on the back and ruffle, pink ruffles on the top. This is the little gingerbread man. I already took this off. I've already been using it, <laughs> but it's a baby pink step ladder. And I just thought that this would be perfect to have up in my room because sometimes it's really hard to get up to my bags and the top of the closet. And I had a little tiny step stool. It just wasn't cutting it. This just is going to be so handy <laughs> to be able to do all of that. And then I went back to Hobby Lobby and I picked up another pair of the baby pink slippers, like the ones that I'm wearing now, and I just love them so much. And these ones, I think I'm just gonna leave plain, or I may add bows, I don't know yet. And then they have really cute, like little jewelry and stuff there. I thought this would be really cute to either, I don't know, tie to a phone case and just have it as like a little charm or have it as like a keychain with my keys. I haven't really decided yet, but I just thought it was really pretty. And I picked up more nails. These were $5.99 at Marshalls. Hobby Lobby had a, a set of erasers. Um, I'm actually giving one to my friend, but I kept the other two and it's like this purpley blue color and then baby pink. Thought these would be perfect for my planning and stuff that I've been doing with my Bible study. And at Marshalls, they have this beautiful plate. I just love the details on it. it has the gold rim and then these really pretty baby pink flowers. And I just thought like eventually, I'm slowly building my collection, but I love going to this tea place that's near a house, but it's almost like 50, $60 every time that we have a high tea party there. And I was like, why don't I just have a high tea party at my house? <laughs> or not $60 every single time. So um, I thought this would be really cute to serve little treats and stuff on. Also at Marshall, well, you know what? I found these at TJ Maxx or Home Goods. These are some of my favorite, favorite, favorite gummies. I only find them at Home Goods. You can get them offline, but they're way more expensive online than they are at Home Goods and TJ Maxx. This is also from Home Goods. My mom and I went there. We went to one Home Goods and then we went to a different location. She found a really pretty cup like this only in white flowers. And then I found one in pink flowers and we're like, we can match. How cute is that? This was $5.99. So in my last YouTube video, I was talking about how I've been looking for these cups and Vanessa and I ended up finding these and then just splitting them. And so I was so excited to find these the other day and now I have three instead of just one. So if I have friends over and stuff like that, we can all drink out of them. <laughs> And then I'm always using cups to drink water because during pregnancy, you obviously want to drink a lot of water and it's nice just having a variety of them. And so of course I had to pick up this one. It's from Hydro Peak and I love their stuff. It has a handle and then the straw pops up and down, which I love that option. So the straw is not always poking out and you can kind of just carry it wherever you are. It's perfect for traveling. I don't know if you can tell, but it's like a baby pink iridescent. And yeah, so this was $16.99 at Home Goods. I ended up, this is also purchased from being inspired by Bria and her YouTube video that she posted. I'll leave a link for her channel so you guys can go watch her. And just tap it right here and then it's rechargeable. You don't have to have it plugged in. And my initial thought was I had screwed up when I built my closet and designed my closet. I knew I wanted to have a coffee bar in here and I had put outlets in. I did not include a hole in the wall or in the counter to hide the cords. What ended up happening is my husband cut a hole and fished the wire through, but I could only have one thing plugged in over there, which, you know, you take the good with the bad. <laughs> 
I still love it I like to have a little bit of light over there and I thought this would be perfect to have over there since I don't need to plug it in I always like to use these really pretty baby pink plates when I have guests over so I picked up the smaller ones and then a little bit bigger ones as well oh I almost forgot bought this beautiful perfume bottle that you could put your own perfume in and it twists off like this and then you can just put it on your wrist or on your neck when you want perfume. I decided I'm not going to put any perfume in here because I just thought the bottle was gorgeous so that's why I bought it. This was at Burlington for $9.99. They also have similar ones at Hobby Lobby, but they're probably a little bit more expensive. The last bag that I have, when we were at Home Goods, no, maybe this is, this is either TJ Maxx or Home Goods, but I just picked up some to-go containers. I thought these were really pretty with the butterflies. Sometimes when we have guests over and we have leftovers and people go home with containers, I just like to have some at the house. And then I also found glass containers that I would just obviously keep for here, but they had the baby pink lids on them and I thought they were really cute. These were from Home Goods for $8.99. And then I went to Marshall's and I found the big set for $8.99. And then I also found this really cute pajama set, pajama dress at Marshalls. This was $9.99 and it says life is good. It has little cute watermelons on the front. And then I also picked up these really cute sandals. I loved the intertwine of the rhinestone and the gold and the baby pink and they're super soft and comfortable and these were $24.99. And then I, of course, had to pick up this really cute Juicy Couture bum bag. I need to tighten the straps. I think I like it right under my boobs. <laughs> Let me just kind of show you guys what it looks like on. This is what it looks like up close. And it has this cute little Juicy Couture heart. This is, reminds me of old school Juicy Couture. And it's a really, really pretty shade of baby pink. This is the inside. Looks like it has a pocket in the back, but I love to take these when I'm out running errands with Audrey because it's super easy. I can leave it on. I don't have to keep taking it on and off and it holds a lot of stuff. I picked up this beautiful baby pink Juicy Couture travel bag. And what I loved most about it was the fact that it came with a little tiny wallet as well with a little juicy keychain on it. So I thought that was really cute. And it's perfect for travel, just throw some things in or even like an overnighter or weekend trip. And so, yeah, pick that up as well. And that was $39.99 at Marshall's. Okay, so the last thing I picked up is from Home Goods. It's this cute little drawer set. It's really cute, and I wanted to kind of do a video on everything that I put in here. I was thinking this could be like a stationary section in my room, so I wasn't taking up drawers from my vanity. That is everything from my video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video you love my hauls and want to see more or if you want to see shop with me videos like and subscribe definitely let me know in the comments down below what your favorite item was thanks for watching